Hey, Serge, uh, congrats on the, the win. Um, you saw a lot of Boston this year, but it was different points of the season, obviously. Now we're looking ahead. I mean, what, what did you learn about them? You had three pretty good games personally and maybe one bad game in the bubble, um, but the team didn't do so well against them. So what, what, what do you think of that matchup? Yeah, one thing we learned about the Boston, we know they are, they are a great team. You know, they play, they're playing one of the best basketball right now. Uh, they have confidence on them, and uh, you know uh, we we know it's not gonna be easier. You know we have to come to play, you know our best basketball against them. Do you think people? Um, obviously, everyone talks about Jalen Brown and Jason Tatum and Kemba, but do you think maybe their big men are a little underrated? Like they've been pretty good for them this year as well. Yes, they. they I mean, I watched one game. Uh, they big, big, uh, big guys be playing uh, very good. You know, maybe they, they know really, get a lot of the talk, you know, but uh, they are a great team, you know, they, everybody, when they come they come in, they play hard, you know, they play as a team, you know, they have good bench, so we need to come in too and to play basketball, man. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Uh, next, we'll go to Bruce Arthur from the Toronto Star. Serge, uh, terrific game. Uh, after this season, like, you guys had guys get hurt all year. You guys finished with the best winning percentage of any Raptors team in history. Um, tonight you lose Kyle and you do what you do. Norm does what he does. This whole team does what it does. What is it about this Raptors team? And we've talked about it all year that, that allows you to keep, that allows you to keep going in moments like that when you lose guys. Man, one thing about us, we know we have a lot of guys, you know, can play, you know, we don't really worry about who's going to score 30 or 40 every night. And we know we don't, we are not that type of team. Well, we are one guy going to score 30 or 40 every night, you know, so we just come and then try to play our basketball, uh, move the ball, you know, whoever is hot, you know, we're going to go with him, you know, and that's that's why we we are always, you know, we are always there even when we have guys down. One thing Nick talked about in the Coach of the Year press conference yesterday is the thing he was most proud of beyond, as a coach of the Raptors is, is that effort that you guys put in every night, that, that you guys try to win every single night, which sounds like something everyone does, but it isn't. Uh, it, what is it that produces that? Because we know the secret, man. The secret of winning in this league, you have to come to play hard every night, to play as a team, and, uh, you know, to defend, you know, to play hard on the both hands of the floor, you know, you know to, to run, to, you know, play for your teammates, you know, that we know. That's why we won last year, and uh, that's why we're going to try to go again to win this year. Thank you, Serge. Is there any other questions for Serge in English? I can ask another one. Okay, yeah, Bruce, if you have another one, feel free. Uh, Serge, uh, this is kind of an obvious one, but Kyle is so important to so much of what you do. The earliest this next series with Boston, it sounds like, can start is Thursday. We don't know what Kyle's status is yet. But can you just speak to the importance of Kyle in making sure that this Raptors team is at the best? You said that. You already said that. I, I don't really have to say a lot. You already said that. He's very important for us. He's our motor. You know, uh, hopefully he can be ready for the first game, you know, because uh, we need him big time, man. We need him big time. Just a last question. We saw all those videos of you in your, your apartment uh, working, but how often did you touch a ball? during the pandemic, during those months? Uh, I just tried. I did uh, wh whatever I can. Um, I was, you know, I had a ball in my, co in, in my condo too, mm -hmm. you know, and uh, as soon as, you know, we got okay to go practice. You know, I was in the gym, you know, walking hard, you know, just try to stay ready, man. Oh, you look comfortable. Thank you, Serge. Uh, we will now shift to Mike from Le Express Toronto. Go ahead, Mike. Bonsoir Serge, félicitations pour la victoire et pour cette belle performance. Euh, je voulais te demander, est-ce que le fait d'avoir réalisé le premier sweep de l'histoire de l'équipe, euh, c'est quelque chose d'important pour vous On sait que pour vous, le plus important, c'est quand même d'aller au bout cette année, mais est-ce que ça représente quand même quelque chose Écoute, euh, oui, c'est bien pour, pour l'équipe, pour la confiance, c'est bien, mais on sait qu'on a beaucoup encore à faire et que le prochain, euh, le prochain tour ça sera vraiment difficile. Par rapport au prochain tour, justement, euh, le banc réalise une performance exceptionnelle avec 100 points ce soir. C'est un record également. Est-ce que c'est très important pour vous que tout le banc soit en confiance, justement, pour affronter ces Celtics Oui, c'est très important parce qu'au au prochain tour, on aura besoin de tout le monde. 
c'est toujours, toujours bien que tout le monde soit prêt et avec confiance. Et pour finir, est-ce que vous êtes un peu inquiet par rapport à Kyle ou, euh, ou vous avez eu des nouvelles rassurantes pour l'instant bon, Pour l'instant, pour les, pour les, pour on ne sait rien, mais j'espère qu'il qu sera prêt pour euh, le prochain tour. Parfait, merci beaucoup Serge. Oui. Uh, Dex, we'll go back to Mike Gantry from the Toronto Sun. Go ahead, Mike. Hey, Serge. Uh, I'm sorry if you've already been asked this. I'm kind of bouncing from one room to the next, so I didn't hear the first part of your interview. But Serge, or um, Nick said the other day that th this is by far the best he's ever seen you shooting the basketball. Um, is it that way for you? And, and why do you think it is like at this point in your career? Yeah, man, if you're asking all, all my teammates, all my coaches, they know I spend a lot of time in the gym, man. Yep. You know, I spend a lot of time in the gym, and uh, when I work my shot, I work, uh, I'm, really, I'm really focused on the details, you know. I don't really, you know, just change the way I, I used to work, you know. Before, I used to come and shoot a lot of shoots, a lot of shots. Now, I focus, I focus more on the details, you know, yep. and the game shots. I think that's that's why. And is, is Nick great? Is this the best that you've ever been shooting the basketball? Yes. All right. I appreciate that. Thanks, Serge. Thank you.